Welcome to Read by Robin. This week we'll be reading the Troll Monster pop-up book. It is written by Karen Raven and illustrated by Marianne Smith. My version is pre-loved as are all of my books so the pop-ups are not fully functional so you'll see me giving them a bit of an extra hand and at the very end the last two pages I am completely missing some stuff so I do apologize for that. So Cyclops Psy has always had a way with little critters. Now he's become the busiest of monster babysitters. Of course, all monster parents like to know that Psy is there to keep an eye on things for them when they go out somewhere. Down at the creepy kitchen, Handy Horace is a whiz. He waits on everyone at once with all those hands of his. When he gets lots of orders, he remembers all that's said. Because for every order, he can use a different head. Let me give this pop-up a little hand up here for you. The Monster Day Parade is held in Monsterville each year, and lots of beastly beings always come from far and near. They give atrocious trophies for the ugliest and the hairiest, the roughest, toughest, guffest, and of course the very scariest. The weirdest rock group in the world is called the Rolling Bones. Instead of singing, a skinny skipper simply moans and groans. Lean Leonard wails on lead guitar, then Theodore plays drums. They put on such scary shows that no one ever comes. It's sad for them. Super Monster is so monstrous that when he takes a swim, the other monsters all jump out the minute he jumps in. This one is a pull tab. And here's the beginning of my missing parts. At Melba's merry parties, guests are careful as can be to mind their monster manners by behaving horribly. Turn the wheel and Riddle Monster will give a quiz to you, and you can look inside his book to find out how you do. His book is missing the answers, though, and I also don't have the wheel. But the questions are, why is it so hard to fool a monster? What do monsters have that no other creature has? Why did the monster eat bullets, and why does a baby monster walk softly? I bet you, if you look it up online, you might be able to find out the answers to these riddles. But I don't know for sure, and I'll never know because my book is incomplete. That is the end of the book, though. I hope you enjoyed it enough to go and find your own copy that is complete. Thank you again for watching. This is children's content, so you won't be able to comment below, but you can like the video and follow the channel. And once again, thank you for watching and pardon my book for being so well loved.